Welcome to Travels Unfiltered. Today we are highlighting the top 10 restaurants and dining experiences in Edinburgh, Scotland. For more travel tips make sure to subscribe to our channel. At number 10 we recommend The Pit. The Pit is Edinburgh's pioneering street food market, showcasing some of the best vendors in Scotland. This is a must visit. Entry is £2 and gives you access to all of the vendors. Note, The Pit is only open on weekends. Coming in at number 9 we recommend Angels with Bagpipes. Located in a 16th century building on the Royal Mile. This restaurant is a mix of both old and new. Its historic location is balanced alongside its contemporary and elegant decor, truly reflect the complex historic yet also modern Edinburgh. Diners are served a seasonal selection of fresh, local ingredients, with an elegant modern twist on traditional Scottish dishes. Diners have the option to order from their a la carte menu or try their four-course set tasting menu. Coming in at number 8 is Borough. Borough is a great option for fine dining at reasonable prices. Owner, Darren Murray was tired of working in restaurants which he couldn't afford to eat it, so he came up with the concept of fine dining at a reasonable price. The menu changes daily to showcase the very best in seasonal produce and all ingredients are sustainable and environmentally responsible. At £35 for four courses, or £18.50 for a three-course lunch, you'll be hard pushed for better value anywhere else. Coming in at number 7 we recommend Bodega. For high-quality Mexican food, Bodega is the place to go. Their taco-driven menu not only takes inspiration from Mexico but also also from Asia, Europe, North America and Australia. They also have a wide range of cocktails, including their famous margaritas, so if you're a fan of Mexican food and margaritas then this is the place to visit. Coming in at number 6 we recommend The Gardener's Cottage. The Gardener's Cottage is a restaurant located in a charming Georgian cottage in Royal Terrace Gardens. The cottage dates from 1836 and was originally home to the gardener for the Royal Terrace. Diners experience an intimate, communal dining setup surrounded by the aromas of the trees, plants and the vegetable garden, making for a decidedly rural atmosphere despite its city center location. You have the option to choose from an a la carte lunch and weekend brunch menu including the option of a full-cooked Scottish breakfast, or a stunning seven-course set dinner menu. Coming in at number five is The Kitchen. The Kitchen is named after one of the finest chefs in Scotland, Tom Kitchen. His Michelin-starred, contemporary restaurant serves modern British cuisine influenced by French cooking techniques and uses the finest quality ingredients available from Scotland making an excellent and relaxed dining experience on Edinburgh's Leith waterfront. Coming in at number 4 is the Whiskey Bar. If you're looking to experience something more Scottish, the Whiskey Bar is place to go. This warm and friendly pub is filled with live music each night and its mission is to be as Scottish as possible. If you're looking for somewhere to try the traditional Scottish dish haggis, then the Whiskey Bar is the place to do so. It offers a haggis stack as a starter or a haggis tower for a main and its slightly higher prices reflect a true dedication to quality and local ingredients. Coming in at number 3 is Locanda de Gusti. For high-quality Italian food, Locanda de Gusti is the place to go. The restaurant uses the finest ingredients which are directly imported from Italy and combine them with the best meat, fish and seafood from Scotland. For those who are gluten intolerant, they have a high range of gluten-free dishes including desserts. They also cater to vegan customers on request. Their menu changes daily, as everything is made from scratch, so there is always something new to discover each time you dine at Locanda de Gusti. Coming in at number 2 is The Table. Launched in 2015, this restaurant is exactly what its name implies. It has one table which caters to a maximum of 10 diners in a single sitting. Interact with chefs as they cook, experience fine dining and performance art while surrounded by a great atmosphere. When eating for dinner you have a 7-course tasting menu. The menu changes regularly and has both Scottish and European influences. Coming in at number 1 is Azel Restaurant. Azel Restaurant was named after the old Scots word meaning, spark. The restaurant is one of the most unique dining experiences you can have, with patrons being presented with a list of approximately 20 ingredients, some familiar, some unfamiliar. From this list diners discard anything that is not to their taste and place themselves in the capable hands of the chef. Diners get a four-course meal alongside with other little extras such as their delicious artisan bread. It's definitely worth stepping outside of your comfort zone to try this experimental approach to Scottish cuisine. All these places have their own unique charm. To book a table at one of these places, see the links in the description box below. If you're traveling to Edinburgh and aren't sure what to do or see, make sure to also check out our video, Top 20 Things to Do in Edinburgh. You can find the link in the description box below. So, with this video almost over it's time to ask you. What's your favorite restaurant or dining experience out of the ones we've mentioned? As always, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you love all things travel, and give this video a like if you enjoyed it. See you next time.